Hey guys, Target Recycle and FPV, and today I've got quite a few Cadex that I'm going to need to be repairing some Vistas here. I'll show you exactly what I'm working on. Um, so let me see if I can get this screen just like that. There we go. All right, so I've got a few over here on the top here. I've got to do some, I uh, did a diode repair on one. i got to do capacitors on one. Uh, but right now what I'm doing is I'm going to focus on this one. This is actually, a, oh, this was seemingly uh, almost a brand new Nebula Pro. And uh, funny, the video just quit working. Um, so we're gonna go through some things real quick on this one, show you guys what we're doing. I've taken the, I've taken it apart already just to get to easier access to the, uh, to where the harness is gonna attach, but let me go ahead and get this camera out. All right, so here's the camera right here, and, and here's a replacement cable. So here's what we did. So I've got a set of goggles right here. Um, these are our test goggles that we use. So I've got the DJIs here, and I will get ready to plug these in. Um, customer says that there's no video uh, when he uses it. So let me get to the um, screwdriver and open this up. Like the video just went out. He was using it and then all of a sudden the video quit working. So automatically assume that maybe there's something wrong with the Vista itself. But um, we're going to, I've already taken the cable apart and this was prior to doing the video. Uh, the cable's already been removed. But let me show you guys the process here real quickly because it did catch me a little bit off guard. I wouldn't have expected this, but let's see what we, let's see what we got, okay? And uh, while I'm doing this, I will say to you guys, and I will put this warning out there, please stop plugging your Vistas directly to the LiPo. I know that they're not limited to the same power as the, um, the input as the uh, air units, but they are susceptible to power spikes, okay? And I'm seeing more Vistas go out, losing OSD, or the Vistas going bad completely, and you're getting these power spikes. So please put a BEC, <clears throat> put some for sort of regulator from the LiPo uh, from the pads to your uh, Vista. Don't, don't wire it directly there, please. Uh, if you do, uh, I, I can tell you that we've put that, I think, on our page now. Um, you know, that's your warning, basically. It's like, look, it's going to go, it, it, most likely in a, in a spike of some sort, uh, it will get damaged. Either the diodes will get damaged and you'll lose your OSD or something else, and that's it, guys. I mean, it'll have to go to Caddx for repair um, if that continues. So, anyways, just, just be cautious of it. It's, you know, take the extra step and you'll save yourself quite a bit. Of headache. All right, so let me go ahead now, and I'm going to go ahead and plug this uh, cable in here. Make sure I have this lined up properly. Sorry. Got to line my stuff up in a little. Not sure if I have it lined up yet or not. I think that's going to do it right there. All right, so our cable is in. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and plug this side in. I'm not going to go overboard on this because I have to take it back apart. But I'm going to go ahead and put this back on for now. I'm not putting the clamp down. I'm not putting the covers over the, uh, the, ca the, the cable to the camera. I will because I'm going to open this back up anyway. But I'm just going to do one last test so I can show you guys. Now, on this one, I did put an XT60. Um, and I will just throw on an antenna. Just something simple for right now. Okay. okay. <clears throat> All right. Now that we've got this on there, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to power it up. And I have my spoke stopper somewhere here. So we're going to go ahead and plug that in. And we're going to leave this voltage at around 12 volts. I'm not worried about it. Let me just go ahead and put this on here. There we go. All right, Cadex light is on, we have power. So we're gonna go ahead now and get our goggles turned on. We get to binding this. So we have a green light on our Cadex right now. So you can see right here. Okay, so now we're gonna get the goggles on and we're gonna to go to bind it. Okay, we're in binding mode. I'll try to show you what I'm looking at. So you can see it's kind of uh, cut in half there. Uh, the videos. I wish I could get a better picture of it. Hold on. No, I don't want to take a snapshot, but 
there. I think you can see there. I mean, it's just pretty grainy and what have you. All right, so uh, this is an issue that we're needing to fix. Um, and what it appears is it appears to be a cable issue. Okay, there we go. All right, and now let's turn it back on. Okay, we got power back up. And we now have perfect video. Okay, so as you can see here, well, I hope you can see, we have, no, there you go. Okay, so we have perfect video. So it turns out that we had a cable issue here. Um, and. It just, it kind of concerned me because I couldn't understand. There no, doesn't appear to be any physical damage on this cable, but nonetheless, uh, I even went down to the pins and looked at the pins, couldn't find anything wrong. So anyways, that's what the repair is. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and close this back up and I'm gonna cut this piece off and we'll be able to seal this back up, but that's it. That's, uh, that's all it takes. Just wanted to show you guys this is a repair uh, where it's actually the first time I've seen a, pretty much a brand new unit um, have a bad cable. Uh, it was flown. But then uh, afterwards, uh, the cable, I guess the, the, the video went bad. Anyways, that's all, guys. Just want to share that with you. If you have any questions, hit me up. Uh, as always, please subscribe to our YouTube. Oh, well, there it goes. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Always appreciate it. And then if you need, you can always find us on our uh, Facebook page. Man, it's been a while since I've done a video. And then you go to our group section if you have any questions. All right, sorry about that, guys. Uh, we'll see you guys soon. Take care. God bless. Be safe. And spend time with your family. You never know how much time I love. So make the most of it. See you soon. Bye.